Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting ring to episode 5 of the Aqua Trope and White Sam BTW. I am so, 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 so sorry that this is a day late. Um, a lot of things happened yesterday. Um, I woke up, uh, my mom wanted to go to the store. <laughs> we actually bought something that, uh, you know, we, we thought we didn't need, but we really, really needed. Came home, um, took a nap, went back out to go get something to eat was stuck at the supermarket for like almost 30 minutes to an hour finally got home because it freaking rained by the time we were getting out of the supermarket um ate rewatched like demon slayer with my mom because i'm getting my mom into it <laughs> fell asleep just kind of now woke back up <laughs> And I'm like, oh my god, I haven't recorded this. I was like, this is the one thing that I have to do today. But, yes, I am really, truly sorry that this is a day late and ish but oh, hopefully this, well, yeah, because it's going to happen again next week. Because, of course, I will be gone next week and such. But other than that, let's go ahead and get started with episode 5 and 3, 2, 1, go. Her mom is definitely going to make her go back home. Hmm. See, I don't want Fuka's mom to take her home because she, in a way, even though we're only five going on six episodes by next week into the show, it feels like this is Fuka's home, like where she truly belongs and such. And you don't really want her to, you know, go away and, and be away from Misa and everyone else, but specifically Misa. <laughs> Heck, I would take this with me next week. But it's too much stuff to lug around, and plus, to the fact is, I'll be busy the three days that I'll be on my little, my second mini vacay. I don't even think I'll have time to sit and watch, like, any of the shows from Thursday, Friday, or even Saturday. So I think it's just better if I leave this here, and then wait until I get back home, and binge everything, and then get it out between Monday and Tuesday with my Patreon shows. Well, she's been a great help to Grandma Gama. Yeah, I mean, she did without even telling you, but. Of course, she's going to take her home. Another yeah, story! <laughs> <laughs> of course not. Okay, then you need to tell your mom how you feel. So you want her to run away again?
This isn't a good idea, though. I think if I did my braids a little bit longer and if they weren't like in a certain way I would love to do that in my hair because <laughs> I can put it in a ponytail but I can't put it in like two separate pigtails It's like episode one all over again. Mm-hmm. So if you don't pass out. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Why not take a train? I mean, you took a train the first time, but do you not have any more money? <gasps> Hi, kitty! Hi, Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> the fact that me is trying to get because mom's super drunk I can't Uh-huh. No. I 
Oh, that's good. Mm-hmm. Um. <sighs> yeah. Still sick, huh? It's fine. Mm -hmm. And she really enjoys working there. Up until the point that you came, like, oh god, what am I gonna do now? My mom's here. Should we? Really? <laughs> Come here, baby. You want attention? I'm like almost done. I have... I got ten minutes left and then I'm all yours.
It's complicated. <laughs> I'm gonna go back, don't you? Yeah, because you liked it there. Mm hmm. Stepped on them brakes hella quick. Like, ooh. not there, is it? It's passing away, isn't it? So sad. Like your old self before you came here? Oh, oh my god. <laughs> hey, big boy. It is.
Thank God. Yeah, that and you can call her too. This was a good episode. Thank God her mom is letting her stay. I was going to be really, really, truly upset if she had to said no and such. But I think it's because of the fact is maybe, just maybe, her mother fell in love with Gama Gama Aquarium just as much as Fuka did in the first episode. I mean, honestly, like, I'm not surprised that, you know, Misa was like, yeah, why don't you just run away again and keep running away and da 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 until your mom <laughs> catches you and demands you to come home. But, I mean, I love the deal that she made with her. She can stay here for the summer until, you know, when school officially starts and then returns back home and to start a new term for school and everything. Because, I mean, of course, Fuka needs this. She needs this to move on from someone who was an idol who now is retired and needs to find out what is her next chapter in her life even though she's only like 15 16 um and such but it happens to all of us we all have that moment where it feels like especially you know with covid that when that happened any of us had like really good high paying jobs and then next thing you know people were getting fired left and right or they had to quit because of covid getting bad and such and so at that time because we were at home for nearly a year maybe even longer because i feel like there are going to be some places that are going to go back on lockdown i feel like here in florida where i live oh hell yeah we're probably going back on lockdown i'm, I'm like 50 percent, maybe even 100 percent sure on that So, are you, the spirit, like, if it is a spirit, does anyone else see it besides? <laughs> That's right. <laughs> that was cute. But like I said, um... Everybody truly had a moment last year and going on this year during the pandemic where it felt like a lot of things were coming up to us all at once and that, you know, we weren't going to be able to hug and see each other again and it's like that. And so a lot of people got depressed last year, hell of a lot. And I'm not saying that maybe Fulka is depressed, but I think it kind of a little bit, especially with the first few episodes when she started versus where she is as of officially as of episode five going on episode six, she's a completely different person. And so with the help of Gama Gama, it is going to make her become a better person. I still kind of feel like possibly by the end of the series, even though we are no way near <laughs> that just yet, I feel like she is possibly going to want to do idol, like try again in the idol industry one more time and to see if she can better herself. I get the fact of, you know, with the flashback episode of her having someone else, uh, have their time in the spotlight and shining and everything to the point where her fans like slowly but surely dwindled every single week and to the point where it was like okay 
I think it's time for me to go. But, like, still, something just tells me that by the end of this, you know, we're going to see her go back to Tokyo and be like, hey, I want to try again on this. And she might even be a bigger and better person and a hell of a better idol than she was before she had left. But I really kind of hope next time that we do get to see Fuka's mom again, we get to see her dad and maybe anyone else in her extended family to come and see her. So hopefully that happens. Um, what else do I want to see? Oh, okay. Um... Kana Hanazono's character. I do want to see her come back. I know she has her kid. A couple episodes ago, her kid was born and such. I do hope we get to see her again. I do want to see the interactive and stuff. I, I'm not. I'm surprised that Lynn's character was not featured in today's episode. But the fact is that she got to <laughs> meet the lady from episode one was sweet. Like, you never know. Them little encounters and everything, just so wholesome and adorable. But other than that, guys, that was my reaction view towards episode five of the Aqua Show for White Sand. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you on Unfortunately, not next Thursday because, like I said, I will be gone from next Thursday to Saturday on my second little mini vacay. So either the reaction to episode 6 will come out either the Sunday I get back or that Monday, Tuesday. And then you guys will see me that following week on Thursday for episode 7. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye!